Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm going to be showing you how to do a cartwheel step by step. Okay, first I'm going to do it just normally. Then I'm going to be showing you how to do a step by step. Just hold on a minute. do it like fast and then I'm gonna show it you step by step okay this is it really fast hope I'm not blocking the line too much okay that is a cartwheel and then now I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be doing five cartwheels I said ten I pointed ten that's weird okay I'm gonna be doing five cartwheels and um, normally, and then I'm gonna show you step by step. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Cartwheel one. Cartwheel two. Cartwheel three. Cartwheel four. Off on cartwheels, but that's okay. Everybody makes mistakes. Days. Everyone has. Them. Okay, I'll stop. Okay. So first, I do not know how to do a handstand, but I can do a half handstand. Like I can just first go up in the air for like two seconds and then go down. But I don't. No, I don't even do good handstands. But if you do know how to do a really good handstand, that will definitely help you do a cartwheel. So first, start off by doing. Oh my God! I told you I cannot do handstands at all, <laughs> whatsoever. But. Yeah, that's the closest I can do to a handstand. Ooh. So yeah, just keep doing handstands. And that's not the only thing that you need to do. First, what you're going to do is you're going to stretch out your legs. I don't even know how to do the splits either. But, so let me just put the camera down a little bit. There you go. Okay. What you're going to want to do is you are going to want to stretch your legs out. Not do the split. At least do this. If you don't know how to do this, put your leg like this, okay? Just crisscross applesauce. Turn a little bit here. Then get your leg out. Then just put it under. And then just that. Do that for about 15 seconds. One, two, three. Switch. I feel like I'm a PE teacher. Okay, one, two, three. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna be doing front rolls. Front rolls can really help you with cartwheels sometimes. So yeah. Front rolls can really help you with cartwheels sometimes so just focus on front rolls for now then um, after this we're gonna get to like actually like the part of cartwheels <laughs> okay wait there you go Sorry, just one more. I love front rolls. Okay. Now I'm going to put the camera here to do the real stuff. Okay. So first what you're going to want to do is do a half cartwheel. Kind of like this. Like this look at. So you're going to do kind of like a handstand, but not really. Focus on when you're doing the handstands to kind of stretch out your legs. So, oh, okay, I was so close to doing that. Okay, I'm really nervous. The last time I tried to do it like that, I, it wasn't good, okay. No, it's too much tiny space here. But try to put your legs like, if you're doing the splits like that. Okay. 
Okay, now you're gonna first wanna do this. It's okay if you keep your legs straight or like that. Make sure you have a good posture. Make sure you're like this and not like that. Okay, so you can rather do this, but for me it's harder to do it like that. I usually do it with a straight leg like this. Then what you do is then you kind of lower your leg down like, like this. Okay, this is really awkward because there's nothing um, playing. But yeah, so you're gonna do, wanna do that and do that. So then you're going to want to do that. Okay, that, bend a little down like toward like leaning like this. Then just, you're gonna lower your leg down. So like that. That. Just when you're done, when you're leaning like that, make sure you kick back your um, other leg too. So like this. And then that. So like this, then um, go down. <laughs> that was bad. Okay, okay. This, um, go down like like that, and then do that. Then do it all together, and you. Good cartwheel. Now I'm gonna be showing you the different cartwheels that I do sometimes. Here is the regular cartwheel. Just a normal, regular, fun disease cartwheel. Okay? Just a regular cartwheel, okay? Now, what I call a truffle cartwheel is pay close attention to my arms. If you're on a cell phone or something or a computer, make sure you zoom in to the ground part like that. Because as you can see, when my um, arms are on the ground, when I'm doing this, like you see it right here, how my arms, I might have to do a little backer, like here. Like this, right here, like how my arms are like that. Yeah, well what I call a truffle cartwheel is instead of putting your arms like this, you put your arms like that. But when you're first like doing this, you're gonna do your hand like that, right? And then when you're going down, it's, you're gonna put your hands with two fists. So I, that's why I call it truffle cartwheel because truffles remind me of chocolate and chocolate are like round. So yeah, um, not all chocolates, but some chocolates are round. I like the chocolates that are round, so that's what it, what I call a truffle cartwheel. So make sure you pay close attention to the floor on this one. And also, usually your legs are like, no, your arms are like that. My arm, you, for truffle cartwheels, you can do it like this. So, see? That's a truffle cartwheel that I made up. I don't know if it's actually a real thing, but, or it's called something else. And also, if this is too hard for you, you can do this. And do it like that, right there. Because it still looks like you have your fists, but you just don't have this. You can do, it looks like your arms are like in circles, right? It's like that, that. So you can do that on the ground, you can do this on the ground, or you can do that on the, you can do, this, um, that, or just the regular. I'm gonna do the reverse truffle. The reverse truffle is this one, the one that I have right now, and not the uh, um, the regular truffle. So this is if it's if a truffle cartwheel is too hard for you and you have to keep do it like that, you can do this. It still looks like it's in circles, but no. It's a way easier to do it. The next one, you need really good practice for. So, the other one I like to call
called the no legged car wheel. So this means you are not gonna do this. No, 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 no. You're gonna do this, and you're only gonna use your legs when you go up in the sky. So the only thing you're gonna do is this again. That is the only time you're using your legs when you go up in the sky, not for support. My legs hate this one the most because they love when they have support. I'm not saying that I don't that my legs when I say when I said I don't like it, it means that my legs probably don't like it, but I like it. But um, it does not hurt your legs at all. My legs probably are just like I'm not used to this. But yeah, like that, that, and now I'm gonna do all cartwheels. Regular. Okay, I'm gonna do it again. Regular, I'm gonna do trouble cartwheel, you have to do that. Oh, that one was kinda bad. Okay. Okay. Hopefully that one's a little better. Okay, I'm gonna just gonna do it one more time just to make sure. <coughs> if I'm doing it properly. <coughs> oh, no. Nah. So instead of doing this one, I was doing, um, instead of doing this one, I was doing that. Okay, truffle cartwheel like this, not like that, not a uh, reverse truffle, okay. Now I'm gonna do reverse truffle, which is way easier. The no legs cartwheel. There you go. Well, uh, anyways, guys, I hope you liked. <sighs> hope you liked my tutoring, and yeah, um, I will see you guys in the next video I post. Well, anyways, guys, I am going to be here for a pretty while. Just again, make sure that you do travel car wheels and all the car wheels you like. <laughs> the cartwheels you like, all the cartwheels you like, all the cartwheels you like. <laughs> so yeah, anyways guys, make sure to give this a like and subscribe. I love you guys so much. Bye!